Hello everyone, welcome to Kindomingo TV. Subscribe to Kindomingo TV and don't forget to click the notification bell to be alerted on our very recent update. My name is Mami Oye. In our headlines, Zenato Rollins comments on her father's way of governance. The National Democratic Congress must preserve the legacy of Rollins, Dan Abudakwi. According to AC Sutherland Adi, the military rule of President Rollins must not be hidden. Asia Dunketia charges the National Democratic Congress members to win election 2020 to honor ex-President Rollins. Rollins lastly to Asia Dunketia. Now to the main stories. The Member of Parliament for Clote Kole constituency and the eldest daughter of the former President Jerry John Rawlins, Zenata Rawlins, has remarked that her late father, Flight Lieutenant Jerry John Rawlins, presided over an all-inclusive administration which always sought the opinions of others during decision-making. Speaking during a vigil organized by the National Democratic Congress, the NDC, in memory of her father on Sunday, November 15th, Zenato said, Rollins led an inclusive government which even before the era of constitutional rule understood the value of everybody's opinion in decision making. She said and I quote, I pray that as we approach the December 7th election, we let these values live within us and absolutely protect what we have as a nation because that is how we all honor his memory. The chairman of the Volta Regional Council of Elders for National Democratic Congress, the NDC, Dan Agudapi, has emphasized the need to defend the legacy of former President Jerry John Rawlins. He made the appeal in a speech read at a vigil held in honor of the late former President Jerry John Rawlins. Beside the Ford Republic, the National Democratic Congress, the NDC, is the greatest living legacy ex-President Jerry John Rawlins left with us and his legacy shall and must be protected and defended at all times. It is the only legacy that has brought hope, equality, equity, justice, accountability, and development into our body of politics. Mr. Dan Agudapi in the speech said, the National Democratic Congress, the NDC, in consultation with the family, will demand full participation in the pre-burial and the burial arrangement of ex-president Jerry John Rawlins. We continue our stories. Renowned Ghanaian writer Professor Isi Sutherland Adi has called on individuals who worked with the late Jerry John Rawlins to document their working experience and encounters they had with him, especially when he was head of state in the military era. According to Professor Sutherland, who once served as a Deputy Secretary for Culture and Tourism under ex President Rawlins, such accounts of events and happenings during the reign of the deceased Ghanaian leader would shape ideas on who the man, ex-president Jerry John Rawlins, truly was. She added that such a move would also give Ghanaians a better understanding of the governance and leadership style of Mr. Rawlins. General Secretary of the National Democratic Congress, the NDC, John Asia Dunketia, says that the best way the party can honor the memory of ex-president Jerry John Rawlins is to win the December 7th elections. He explained that the National Democratic Congress supporters must stay true to the principles of property and accountability, which are the principles of the June 4th, 1979 revolution, which is associated with the late Jerry John Rawlins. He said, and I quote, the principles of Rawlins are good, but they will be important if we are in opposition. So the best tribute to President Rawlins is to be committed to the rescue mission. So be fired up by the temporary demise of our founder to win this election and rescue this nation. Ghana, which was dear to his heart, suffers from the very ills he fought against all his life. 
Corruption today is worse than that which he fought against on the occasion of June 4th. Nepotism today is worse than what occasioned the June 4th revolution. Let us fight to come to power. Let us revisit the idea for the June 4th becoming one of the national holidays. We can only do this when we are in power. As Sia Dunketia said at a vigil organized in memory of the late former President Jerry John Rawlings at Obra Sports in Accra. It has emerged that the late ex-president Jerry John Rawlings was delighted with his first daughter, Dr. Zenato Ajiman Rawlings' political career. Hence, it was Mr. Rawlings' wish for his daughter to be successful in the political field. General Secretary of the National Democratic Congress, the NDC, John Asir Dunketia, revealed this in an interview on Accra-based OKFM. Mr. Asir Dunketia said Mr. Rawlings on several occasions urged him to give Dr. Ajiman Rawlings the utmost support for her success. According to him, the late president pleaded with him to be a mentor to his daughter, adding that he had been proud of her. Mr. Asir Dunketia then urged Dr. Ajiman Rawlings' constituency to vote massively for her come December 7th. Catch you on our next video. Connect with us Facebook Kindomingo TV, Instagram Kindomingo TV. Subscribe to Kindomingo TV if you haven't, and don't forget to click the notification bell to be alerted on our very recent updates. My name is Mami Oye. Thanks for watching. Hello, welcome to Kindomingo TV. Kindomingo TV wants to make this year's election easy and stress free for every Ghanaian. As soon as the results are counted and collated, we will immediately send it to your phone. In less than 5 minutes, we will transmit the counted results straight to your phone. All you have to do is subscribe to Kindomingo TV and then click the notification bell. My name is Mami Oye. Thanks for watching.